I'll show you guys. I don't know if y'all hear, but the train is going off in the background. So, something about you answering the call could be significant. I hope some of y'all are answering y'all call. Well, I hope all of you are answering your call. Doing the things that you was guided here to do. Why this car is sticking out? So, let's just do a quick message here for you guys right quick. I haven't pulled from this deck in a couple of days. I just heard that with that um with the train horn going off in the background i just heard that song you could be seeing your birthday number a lot let's see what's going on here with the energy what's going on here spirit thank you so much hmm. so maybe some of you are answering your call here thumbs up good job this person seems very happy, very content with themselves. You could be getting ready to um, get congratulated on something here. Mm, we got another old man at the bottom of the deck here. <laughs> if this was, if you was an uh, old person here, you could be an old person watching. You know, thank you, babe, for watching the channel. <laughs> Sending you peace, love, body, protection. If you are old. <laughs> Not to call you old, but you know what I'm saying. But if this was you and another old person, like, say, say for instance, if you was already old. I'm not saying that you are old watching, but you could be. But I'm really not getting that you are old, but this is just an example. Say if you was old and somebody else was old. It's like, you would be doing, you your life would be all up here. You would be doing, I don't know, child. I'm just, I don't know. I don't know what I was getting with that. <laughs> But I ain't even trying to force it. I'm not even going to force it. I just seen 222 on the timer. Give me one more. Let's get one more. Thank you. Let me get a SpongeBob one, please. I like the SpongeBob cards. Okay. Here it's still going off. <laughs> okay, thank you for giving me a sponge problem. This has had to be Squidward, huh? <laughs> we got Squidward here. <laughs> he looks so conniving, like he about to do something real devilish here. What you got going on, Squidward? your dumb ass. <laughs> I don't know why. I just wanted to say that. I ain't trying to call Squidward dumb, but I don't know. I feel like I feel like that's for somebody. Somebody thought that was an evil genius. I don't know. It's giving me that evil genius type of energy here. I feel like there's somebody here that watch way too many um like TV shows and shit. Way too many um magic shows or something like that it's giving that type of energy it's giving um the house of dragons it's giving lord of the rings it's just giving the evil guy in cartoons that's what the end this, this is the energy is giving here something about the energy is like real weird right now <laughs> i don't know what that is but it's real weird I swear I was just about to close out this damn reading. When I seen 222 on the timer, I was about to close out the damn reading. I ain't gonna lie to you. <laughs> I'm finna close this shit right out and start over. But something stopped me. So, let's see here. this card right here what's this talking about thank you okay we got trapped in fear okay so what's this we got spiritual strength 
don't know. Because now I'm getting like the roles are reversed or something. Something about the words, the, the uh, damn. Something about the roles being reversed. <laughs> you know what this is giving? It's giving you being the villain and somebody else being like, you know, like smiling at you. Like, oh, uh, you know, <laughs> you okay? You doing good? We all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We fine? Okay. Yeah, let's, let's keep it like that. Somebody's worried here. Somebody is scared of your ass right now. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody's scared of you right now. Because you in this energy right here, this is you. I thought this was you at first. But that's not what it's giving me no more. With the spiritual strength being out here, it's not giving me that no more. It's giving that God is lifting you up. It's giving God is like bringing your shadow side out. Showing people a side that they ain't never seen before from you. And this is like a lot of a lot of um like light workers, healers, you know, black sheep and everything, gold star seeds, empaths, you know, however you want to name yourself. A lot of a lot of us are being this energy right now. A lot of us is in this you got me fucked up energy. <laughs> I don't know. That's what I'm getting here. And that's a part of answering the call. It's a part of answering the call. Like, yeah, you didn't cost somebody in something. You caught somebody. You sending somebody to spiritual jail right here. Clarify this trap and fear. Power want to come out, but it didn't. Oh, hold on. That card just fell. We got light. Child, and I just said you could be sending your birthday number and look at that shit. My birthday number pop out. 819. Look at that. My goddamn birthday number. Let me find out this reading for me. Let me find out. <laughs> Your birthday could also be August 9th. Or your birthday could also be August 19th. Let me find the fuck out. And I just said you could be sending your birthday number. What the fuck? Definitely messaging this motherfucker for me. <laughs> it don't mean that's not a message in here for y'all though. But it's definitely one in here for me. <laughs> Who the fuck over there scared like a motherfucker? A lot of people. Yeah, your ass should be fucking scared. What's this spiritual screen here? Okay, we got destiny here with solar pleasure chakra. Your birthday could also be um, September 3rd, September 10th, March 9th, March 10th, October 3rd, October 9th. Hmm. Solo pleasure chakra with destiny. It's like somebody's fooling their purpose here. What did I just say? Answering the call. Destiny. That's answering the call. Someone's in their destiny here. That's a, like I said, a lot of light workers, like healers and stuff like that, we, we coming into our purpose fully now. Yeah, somebody has been disposed here. Somebody's being exposed. We got loneliness at the bottom of the deck. I know that I am never alone. Yeah, somebody's ancestors are shedding, shedding light on somebody here. Somebody's being exposed. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody's being exposed. Okay. I kind of want to pull from somewhere else, but I don't know where. Hmm. So I'm going to pull like, I'm going to get three cards from each side of the deck here. I'm only going to get three. And if they don't come out by itself, I'm not going to take it. Okay, spirit, that's what I'm going to do here. We got cleanse negative energy as I split the deck here. So they could be a need for you to cleanse negative energy or you already been cleansing negative energy here. And there could be somebody else here that's having problem cleansing negative energy. You know, they can dish out the negative energy, but they can't never get rid of it on themselves, though. 
Let's see here. Give me some messages here for this card right here, Spirit. Thank you so much. Something could have also happened on August 19th, you know. I could just be saying that for myself. But I'm amazed how my birthday is out here. And I just said that you could be seeing your damn birthday number. You don't know what you do to me almost came out. And we got don't open door. I don't know why this significant. But baby, somebody might end up knocking on somebody's door. And don't open that shit. Don't open that shit. <laughs> Don't open your door for somebody. Give me something else here. Let me get two more. What's important here? We got what goes around, comes back around. Yep. And Grim Reaper. Let me get one more. Yeah, somebody about to end up in poverty here. Protect your energy here. You, you are cleansing out negative energy here. And you got a lot of people that's about to experience some heavy ass poverty. That's really going to try to come back into your life. Don't do it. I hear your ass, spirit. I hear you loud and clear, baby. No way. People are spying on you because they know what's happening. This card come out so damn much. I know y'all can probably barely see it. My bad. Let me adjust the camera. All right. Give me three for here. Yeah, so whoever this is that's in this uh, trapped in fear energy, they're watching you from afar. Peekaboo, bitch. I know you're watching my channel, ho. I know you're watching my channel, you know. I feel like you're wrong and you dusty for all that bullshit you was doing behind my back. But, you know, it's all love from afar. It's all love from afar, but don't bring your ass nowhere to fuck near me. Nowhere, baby. Give me something right here. Shit. As far as I'm concerned, you a goddamn... <laughs> You somebody I don't know, baby. We got don't be afraid. Hmm. I seen twelve twelve on the timer. You could be saying agent number twelve twelve. Don't be afraid. Why you got what they got to do with you? Spirit could be telling you don't be afraid. Probably telling your ass don't be afraid here because this other side of you might end up creeping up on you or something. I just seen psychic abilities when I spit the deck. I feel like you're not afraid. But if there is a thing for you being afraid, we got they embarrassed for coming against you. Yeah, somebody's afraid of you though. I don't feel like you're afraid of anything here. But what I'm mainly getting with that is like, don't be afraid of your own power, your own energy. Don't be afraid of your power is mainly what I'm seeing here. Especially with spiritual strength being out here and solar plexus chakra. It's almost as if like your power is about to get ready to turn on or something. I feel like you're about to get ready to go through an upgrade. Something about your energy is about to be upgraded and it's going to probably scare the shit out of you. <laughs> we got to cover up right here. Crazy because we got to cover up right here. I don't know why spirit made me see that. Something about your dad's side of the family could be doing something to you. Hmm. They ass going to be stuck too. And I was just talking to somebody I was giving a reading to today. And thank you so much, sweetie, if you're watching the video. Like, I love you lots. And I really do appreciate that reading that I did for you. And I'm let y'all know this right now. I don't do readings for everybody. I'm sorry. Like, you best believe I'm going to consult with my spiritual team to see if I need to do a reading for you. So... I'm just saying, don't don't expect no reply, you know, all the time when you write me, cause baby, I'm consulting with my spirit team, and the spirit say no, I'm not gonna write you back, you know, and it just it just how it is, you know, and it's for it is not to say that because I don't want to do a reading for you, it's just that I just listen to my I listen to my intuition, cause I'm not trying to say that I shouldn't do a reading for you because you might be karmic or anything. Or you might be like somebody that's just trying to peep into my energy. Sometimes it's just that some people just don't be needing a reading the way you think you do. You know, that could be another reason why spirits say, spirits say don't do a reading for somebody. I don't know. I just had to say that. But I was just talking to somebody I got a, I gave a reading for a, a reading to today. And I was telling her how um 
a lot of people don't really be knowing who their dads are and always have issues with their mom because these are really like star seeds. Like we really are like the, you know, the quote unquote chosen ones, you know, empaths, stuff like that, light workers, however you want to say it, don't really matter. But those are the type of people that we are. And normally we set up in family structures like this in order for us to not only heal generations of pain, but also to like feel all the pain and the anger that people put on to us. Because there's something about needing that during this time that we're living in right now. It's like it's it's like Kendrick Lamar, basically. I'm getting heavy ass Kendrick Lamar energy. Like Kendrick Lamar is so fucking scary, yo. This man is so fucking scary. <laughs> but I love it. My favorite track was Meet the Grounds. I swear to God. Like, oh my gosh. He diabolically spliced that man, man. Oh, I love it. I love it. Give me one more here. Something about a high priest here. Somebody can have somebody on their dad's side of the family that's a high priest. See, most of you don't know people on your dad's side of the family, even if you think you do, you know. We got walking judgment. You walk in judgment for people. We got mini Messiah, Messiah seeds. I only want to get one at a time. Let me get one spirit. Thank you so much. I'll look at it though. What a time to be alive. I just watched a movie that said it had... I literally just watched a fucking movie 30 minutes ago. And one of the lines in the movie was, what a time to be alive. <laughs> when, I walk, when I walk in, sit up straight. I don't give a fuck if I was late. Then what man on the G5 is my idea of an update. <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, yeah, what a time to be alive for like love. I hear love reigns all. Love reigns supreme. If you are a lover, if you know that God is really love, like stand the fuck up, period. We got mystic powers here. I feel like you're triggering a lot of people right now. Because something, I just said that. Somebody having an upgrade here. That's why spirits say don't be afraid. Because something about your powers are about to enhance here. And it might end up triggering you in some type of way. Especially if you're not used to being, like, you know, just like a villain, basically. And it don't always have to be no bad thing, people being in a villain era. I feel like a lot of people get that misconstrued because I've been seeing a lot of videos where people praise being in their villain era, but then you got some people that be like, no, don't be in your villain era. Like, take it to another type of step because that's real, like, devilish and demonic. But people really don't be getting it, though. They don't get it. And again, that's why I keep come, going back to Kendrick because it's like, it's, I, don't know, it's, I don't know, it gives me a fucking Kendrick Lamar feeling. That's what it gives me. It gives me that feeling. Like if you like you met you mess with me, I'm gonna show you just how how diabolical I can be. And it's like that's where light workers are at this moment in their life because they get they've been pushed over so much. And the time that we're living in right now, people they really gonna want to try to try people because they're not gonna they're not able to harness people's energy like that no more. So they need to be around us. These people about to be fuck. These people about to be ten times more scared than we are as our powers increase. They about to be ten times more scared than we are going through this ascension because this gonna be the moments where they really need us. And some of these people they gonna press, and you gonna have to give them this type of look. You gonna have to give them that type of energy. I'm just saying, it is how it is for some people. I don't feel like every light, you know, light worker got to go through that, but hmm. I feel like being in, the, being in your villain era is not always a bad thing. Give me some more right here. Three more. What else here? Thank you, spirit. We got one person involved. So this could just be one person for some of you. And that's a confirmation. So for some of you, this is not more than one person that's in this energy. It's one person that's in this energy right now. This person want to check up on you so bad to see if you're doing good. <laughs> 
What am I trying to say? They ass, bro. Give me some more here. We got you so beautiful to me. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what that supposed to mean? Cause you staring in that goddamn soul. Oh my goodness. It's like, hey, I just see Roman's revenge. Do you see what I'm saying? Is this the thanks that I get for putting you bitches on? Is it my fault that all of you bitches gone? She listened to thank you note, you little hoe. Now I'ma wrap your coffin with a bow. Nigga, she just mad cause you took the spot. Where's that bitch mad cause I took the spot? with well, bitches you ain't shitting to get off the pot. <laughs> Transfer your good energy to them. They're, they're running out, you love. I'm about to stumble over my words a little bit. As I always do sometimes. <laughs> But what I just say, they really gonna need our energy. Oh man, thank you, spirit. Like y'all fucks with me for real, right? And I love that. I love how y'all always coming through like this. Okay, give me one more. I just said that. <clears throat> I ain't gonna look at those. Let's get one more here from this deck. Thank you so much. Mm-hmm. All those energy harvesting days are over with. Especially, um, mm -hmm. we got a black gatekeeper out here showing their face. They really play with you. Apex predator. And you are royalty. Man, I'm telling you, man, look. <laughs> These motherfucking gatekeepers out this bitch. Let me tell y'all old ass is something. You bitches better look at that light worker. We got light worker with letter. You probably about to get some type of uh money or something here. Focus on your kids. You about to receive a letter here. God know who you are. God know who you are, light worker. God know who you are, light worker. Like period. The fuck. I just seen revenge. Yeah, revenge again with that um. People in powerful places. So there's some like uh some black gatekeepers here. They don't even have to be no black gatekeepers. They don't have to because I, I seen Boule. That the uh the Boule. It don't have to be them though. It could be any fucking body that's in power, to be honest. They don't need it, it don't even fucking matter at the end of the goddamn day. These old heads better move the fuck out of our goddamn way. We not playing with these motherfuckers no more. What they thought what what they thought? They already knew this time was coming. What the fuck? You already knew. Like, step the fuck out the way. Be gone. Look, cause it's time for the motherfucking world to change what you're talking about, and it's gonna change. And if you ain't with it, what, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, bro. I don't know what to tell you. It's changing, though. You ain't gonna do shit about it. You ain't gonna do nothing about it. You can't do nothing about it. The fuck? You ain't got no goddamn power. Look at that 144,000. Like, stop playing. Sudden Dove, stop playing. Stop playing out this bitch. For real. It's time for the 144,000 of chosen ones to change the fucking world. Just like people always knew it was going to happen. And it don't matter what what, what type of name you want to give it. Because don't always like I don't always look at the 144,000 as just being a thing for chosen ones. I also look at it on like a, a deeper level. Like as part of like our DNA. The cells in our body. You know our junk DNA and everything. It's not, it's not just about 144,000 people. I don't just look at it like that, you know. It's so many different areas in life that you can place that 144,000 number in. So it's it's deeper for me. But you get what the fuck I mean, though. Y'all get what I mean. With love, you know. These people better get the fuck out of our goddamn way. I just seen class in session. <laughs> Yo. Look, get out. They need to get the fuck out. Get the fuck out our way. <laughs> Yo, thank you, Spirit. I just said he need to get out our way and then get out, show his face. Man, stop playing with Spirit. What? Give me two more here. <clears throat> I keep seeing Roman's Revenge. Just bring it out, spirit. Just bring out Roman's revenge. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I, I'm hearing that song again. I 
I am not Jasmine. I am Aladdin. So far ahead, these bums is lagging. Assuming that see me and that new thing, bums is gagging. They're not capable of love. Underdog. Jealous. Mm, says you wouldn't be shit. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. Now they gotta eat your shit. <laughs> Keep my name out your mouth. Your energy is being restored. Tell them to be quiet. Man, I'm telling bruh. You know what this is giving me? I'm not going to take none of these cards, but you know what this is giving me here? It's like, it's like light workers always had this type of energy within them. But because so many people try to, well, not even try, they do. Because so many people energy harvest off of us, you know, depend on who, who they are. Like, especially if you've been going through this since a child. And I feel like most of us, I feel like all of us, if you resonate with this, go through this as a child. Like they 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 harness all of our like all our power, all the power that do make us be in this energy, that do make us stand up for ourselves, that do make us you know, motherfucker look at you, they get scared type of energy. I don't know, I don't fully understand what I'm trying to say, my goddamn self, but I feel like some of y'all get where I'm coming from, and thank you for that. <laughs> Cause I feel like I just put them words all over the place. Let's keep it going here, Spirit. Give me two more here. Pisces almost came out. They don't want to appear as messy as they are. Mm. Give me one more. We got Karmic. Your path is clear. Mm -hmm. You clearing out a lot of your Karmic energy. I feel like you clearing out all your Karmic energy. To be honest. That's what we're here for. We're here to clear our karma. For our souls to grow. Those of us who do have souls, that is. Give me one more hair, spirit. Thank you so much, love. Man, I love y'all so fucking much. Ah, oh, Roman's Revenge came out, y'all. It came the fuck out. I might take all these cards. Because it came out. And Time for the World to Change came out, too. That's what I'm talking about, spirit. God warned them about you, didn't listen, and we got rage, y'all. What the fuck did I just say? Did I not just say that this is exactly how most light workers gonna be? Man, these people ain't never fucking seen a style like this of us. But for but I'm, I'm gonna tell you like this. <laughs> this ain't even, this is like, I don't, it's giving me like a projection type of energy. Like you gonna be somewhere off in, you know, who knows land, whatever land you want to call it, la la land or whatever. You gonna be off somewhere happy. But it's like it's going to be another, it's like doppelganger energy is giving me a little bit. Like you're going to have another side of you that's going to be sneaking up on these motherfuckers, scaring them. Like pissed, like mad. Like you said, I wouldn't be shit. Nigga, you ain't shit. The fuck you talking about? I don't know, <laughs> know y'all. That's what it's giving me. Like God is not playing. God warned these people. Not playing. Romans revenge. Like, once again, the angels are fucking warriors, okay? Stop it. We got This Is Your Destiny as I spit the deck. What came out? Destiny. You are in your destiny. Like, stop it. You could need to drink more water here. If you ain't been getting enough water, drink more water. Like, stop it. Ain't nobody gonna stop this from happening for you. Especially when you willingly walking into your destiny. You think you think you think your team gonna play about you when you actively trying to walk in your destiny and you got these cock eyes sitting there here trying to stop you? No. No, it ain't going down like that. <clears throat> Give me some more right here. Like stop. God is so funny. <laughs> I swear, God is so funny. <laughs> Oh my gosh, <laughs> y'all! When I tell y'all, I have I be having conversations with God like, like for real, and they be all type of conversations too. <laughs> I'm walking on thin ice with you and God. Like, stop fucking playing. <laughs> Look, be talking to God like, man, shit. They got me. They got me and you fucked up. They got both of us fucked up. Shit. 
Yeah, they talking about. <laughs> oh my gosh. I see drug dealer out here. Switch that bird. Give me some more hair. What else? Your anger is powerful. You see what I'm saying? I just seen three, three, three on the timer too when I looked up. Your anger is powerful. Be very afraid. These people, you best believe they as being very afraid right now. They scared. Be nice to animals slash insects. Somebody here is very harmful to animals. And that's another reason why they narcissistic ass. I'm gonna get this goddamn revenge here. We got a narcissist out here. It fell on top of Roman's revenge. Mm. Give me one more. <clears throat> I don't know what it is about you, mystery. Look, I bet they ass care now. I bet they care about what they did to you now. Stay committed to the journey. That's what I'm saying. Like, you actively trying to walk in your path here. And these people see you doing it. They see you doing it. But they still want to come for you. When it all falls down. That they made a monster out of you. The spirit say, turn it on the back. And they over here talking about something. I don't know what it is about you, mystery. You ain't supposed to be trying to figure out what, the, what it is, you fucking psycho. You know, get, get yourself checked, bro. I'm out here a psychopath, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but, they, but people forget, you know, who made you as a, as a fucking psychopath. Your creator. That's who. So that means that your creator is an even more of a psychopath. Okay. Give me some energy here. Oh, we got not your real parents that came out. Mm, not with medical fields. Oh, we. Baby, baby, baby. Oh, wow. And then I, I see Ezra, uh, Ezra Lee. I forgot how, how to pronounce her name. Ezra Lee Duntor. The protector of women and kids. All my friends are dead spirit team. Ooh, somebody got Ezra Lee Duntor protecting them. And then we got pregnant on the back. Child, are you pregnant? If some of you are pregnant right now, you got Ezra Lee that's really protecting you here. Or something about when somebody's mom was pregnant or something. Somebody really could have been switched at birth or something here because I'm getting that. Not your real parents, medical fields, pregnant, Ezra Lee done tour, the protector of women and kids. Like the cars are like speaking about a pregnancy here. I don't know. Somebody could be getting karma for something that they did in the past. I spent the deck on tired. Had to endure a lot. Your whole life. Seeing how you feel. People are seeing how you feel because now you're going cold-blooded on them. They're realizing that you was really sent by God here. And your ex could have tried to sacrifice you. <clears throat> Let's see here. Give me some more. Give me two more. I just feel like there's a whole bunch of fucking secrets. Like, you know, if you're meant to find out these secrets, then you will find it out. I don't even give a fuck about it no more, to be honest. All I know is that a motherfucker got us fucked. Like, get the fuck out of our way. Stay out of our life. Stop trying to fucking interfere. Like, bitch, just move the fuck on. I don't got time for y'all ugly asses no fucking more. Motherfucker got their own goddamn life to be living. Like, fuck you. We got to stand up for yourself. You see what I'm saying, man? It's giving me that energy, bro. Like, what the fuck, man? Get y'all bitch ass on some motherfucking where the fuck? Ancestors kicking that goddamn ass. Yeah. I want to sit there and call somebody. Ooh. 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 <laughs> All right. Okay, it's here. I'm not going to do it. Ooh, I'm not going to do it. I ain't going to do it. It is what it is. It is what the fuck it is. 
But this is the part of you spending enough for yourself, though. A card just flipped out here. What's that? Let me see what that card is. That motherfucker just flipped out. We got the hang one. This is like sacrificial lamb here. Catching on to something. Yeah, you caught on to something here. You got somebody ass tied by a goddamn, tied by a rope here. Somebody tied. Care about this. Let me see. Because it came out for a reason. Wow. The Knight of Cups just came out too. Now look at gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh, want to come in and reconcile? No, no, no. No, let me put them back the back. No, no. Mm -mm. Give me something right here for this. We got the five of wands of earth. No, they don't want to fight no more. <laughs> I'm here to catch the bar song, the, uh, the bar. Uh, what do you say? What is it, the praise? You don't want to work with me no more. Okay. <laughs> You don't want to work with me no more. Okay. <laughs> you don't want to fight with me no more. Okay. I'm still going to bring this smoke to your ass. And I ain't even got to be right there with you. I'm out of dad's over here fucking scared. <laughs> What's that five of wands of birth? They had the five of cups. And then we got the five of pentacles at the bottom, y'all. Somebody saying five, five, five right here. <laughs> What's this five of wands of birth? With the two of cups, like, oh, you know, let's just rekindle our relationship, you know, let's just balance things out, you know. I, again, with the, I don't mean, I didn't mean this, I didn't mean it, like, no, yes, the fuck you did, bitch, shut up, shut up, shut up. Yes, you did, yes, you did, own up to it, yes, you did. That's why your ass can't change the heel now, because you don't want to own up to you being a fucking hater. Just admit that you was a hater at one point in time, okay? Just admit it. Don't be scared. What's this five of wands of verse two of cups? Don't be fucking scared. We got the high priestess. Because we already know with the high priestess. We already know. Because most of us are high priestess, high priests. We already fucking know. The fuck? Care about this walking on thin ice with you and God. I'm seeing the double. We got the death, baby. Ooh, heavy on your ancestors. Heavy, 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 heavy on your ancestors, baby. Clarify this, Delph. Man, somebody is seeing spirits like a motherfucker right now. I promise you they are. That's what they seeing right here. That's exactly what they seeing right there. With the magician. Somebody was doing death magic out this bitch. Somebody was doing death magic on you. Really? And now they... Oh, somebody... What's the magician here with the Delph? Yo... If they not seeing it already, somebody here about to be real spooked. I'm talking about they about to be real spooked. We got everything is fine in reverse. Mm. Somebody's not going to be doing good, yo. Oh, somebody's not going to be doing good. And they could even be a death here. I'm just going to be honest. Like, somebody here going to lose their life. I'm just going to keep it a book. I mean, what the fuck do people expect? You get what you fucking put out. What goes around comes back around. You did this fucking death magic on somebody. So when it comes back to you, it's going to make you pass away or somebody around you going to end up passing away. That's what the fuck you get, though. That's what you get. You asked for this. You the one that did it. That's your fault. You got to live with that. Child, give me something right here. I ain't gonna make this reading too long. Give me something right here. Ooh, that card just fell out. Hold on. We got the Knight of Pentacles. Spirit wanna say thank you. I'm I'm here and thank you. I'm here and thank you. Mm, hold on. Cause now I feel like Spirit got a message for you specifically. What do you want my collectors to know specifically for them? Oh. Ray just fell out. This could be raided as in like somebody been about to get ready to get raided here. But I'm also seeing like roast spray. Look at that. Spirit is contacting you. I just said I feel like Spirit has a message for you. Somebody here about to get raided. 
Look at that. God isolated you. Hidden in plain sight here. While people sitting up here picking on you, energy harvesting off of you, talking mess about you, doing God knows what, trying to sell their soul to, to the devil to get your soul. And the whole time they being tested. We got they want us to fight. Something about the 90s here. You could have been born in the 90s. Somebody is Haitian here. And we got to forget. Somebody know you're not going to forget him. That's why this card is like in uh on the back. Somebody know you're not going to forget him. But it ain't about you forgiving them, you know, at least not to their face. You forgive to keep moving forward. But yeah, I'm getting something about, uh, I said Spirit had a message. So what's your message here to the collective right now, Spirit? What you want the collective to know outside of this? I just ain't remember. Ooh, it wanted to come out too. Remember who you are? We got to cut them off. Yeah. Cut them off. Whoever you are already cut off, keep keep them cut off. Cleanse negative energy. Whoever you've already cleansed out your energy, no. Ain't no coming back. There is no coming back. And again, I feel like Spirit wants to thank you here for cutting people off. Clarify this, cut them off. I feel like Spirit wants to thank you for cutting people off. Like, actually listen to your intuition, you know, trusting those nudges that you was getting. We got emergency. Clarify if I just cut them off. Or, I just seen 808. I want to use a, a different deck. Clarify this, cut them off. Yeah, a lot of people about to start dealing with their childhood trauma now. And they're not going to want to. <gasps> we got Aboriginal. Oh my gosh. Y'all talking about the ancestors are really coming through here. And if you're not an aboriginal baby, I don't know. This message might not be for you. If you ain't no skin folks, kin folk, this message might not be for you, babe. And then if you're not an aboriginal, but you don't have to be, we got to move to your purpose on the back. I'm telling you, man, like you've been actively trying to move towards your purpose. We got bioelectric abilities here. Again, with the cells in our body. That power being activated, the junk DNA being activated here. Let me see something. Let me go on. Let me go on and finish clarifying these cards, y'all. The answers is coming through here heavy, yo. What's this Knight of Pentacles here? But yeah, thank you for like taking your time. Taking your time. And I'm also getting like not always. I never got a message like this with the four of cups before, but I'm getting something about you not always wanted a handout, you know, that you really actually wanted to do some things on your own. I feel like a lot of character has been built within you over the years. You've you built a lot of character and everything that you have coming your way is very deserving because you're going to help so many people. And there's a lot of you watching this video that's going to help so many people, even if it's just online. What's this Knight of Pentacles here? Yeah, I'm like, you didn't you didn't always want to accept handouts here. It's like you would get mad at times when you couldn't accomplish some things on your own. And I feel like Spirit right, really loved that about you at times. Even though you came off a little big-headed, you know, like, sit your ass down somewhere. I mean, you are sitting down. But it's like, sit your ass down somewhere, man, and just, you know, know that you got our help, our, our guidance. Even if you did know that you had guidance from a higher power, even if you couldn't explain it at times, it's like, I don't know. I'm just getting like a, re a warrior energy. I'm getting a screen card real heavy. I'm getting a screen card real heavy. It's, it's giving a warrior energy. We got the star. What's well, the Knight of Pentacles? We got the moon. Somebody has a lot of spirits around now. 
I feel like the I feel like the spirits, the ancestors around all of us at this time, especially those of us that's really trying to move towards our north node here with the star, they all around us. What's the Knight of Pentacles here with the moon? With the Eight of Wands, communicating. Mm-hmm. Clarify this Roman's revenge. Think the Queen of Swords, baby. If that ain't fucking giving Roman's revenge energy. We got the world here with the Eight of Pentacles. <laughs> so it's more like getting revenge when it comes to your work here, especially online. Heavy on the online uh, platform here. It's time for some of y'all to go ahead and start that uh start that channel, okay? On whatever platform you want. It's so many, it's so many platforms out here. It's time to go ahead and put that content out online, okay? Because that's revenge all in itself right there. What's this word here with the Eight of Pentacles? With the Eight of Swords, yo. And some of you are already online. And that's why with the Page of Wands. I'm talking about very, very adventurous here. Like nobody's going to stop you. You ready. You ready. And although you have a lot to learn on the journey here. Because you you like some a lot of you are in Page of Wands energy. But it's like you ready. You a strong ass page of wands, if anything. But look at that trap and fear with the eight of swords. This is the eight of swords. Yeah. Some of you people are watching you online right now in this eight of swords energy with the seven of wands because you're standing up for yourself, baby. And stand up for yourself came out after I was talking all that shit earlier. <laughs> Clarify stand up for yourself. With the knight of wands. Ooh. Ooh, what's the Knight of Wands here? I'm talking about somebody ain't playing with the Page of Pentacles. It's like, meet me in the field, bruh. Fuck all that yappity, yappity, yapp. Man, meet me in the field. What you, what? Let's talk talent with talent. Let's talk changing lives with changing lives. Let's, let's talk about who really out here pushing P. I don't know why I wanted to say that. <laughs> pushing the people. Towards positivity. Yeah, pushing P, pushing positivity. Okay, pushing P. We out here pushing P. What you talking about? <laughs> we out here pushing P. Let me see you pushing T. <laughs> Can't take it so fucking funny. Clarify this time for the world to change. Yeah. What they talking about? Spirit, God, ancestors. What they talking about? What they talking about? They ain't talking about shit. They ain't talking about shit. What's the devil? They ain't talking about nothing. It's time to silence that motherfucking ego of yours, baby. That ego don't run nothing. That ego don't run nada. With the two of wands here. I'm getting Saturn energy here. I'm getting Saturn with this double. I said I'm going to make the reading that long, baby. And we already at 48 minutes. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm also getting something about... um. Because I keep saying it 48 again. I'm getting something about, uh, damn, the solar plexus, not solar plexus chakra, the solar flares. Like that solar flare that happened on April 8th. It's, man, it's something about that damn solar flare that happened on April 8th, man. Because I'm telling you, after April 8th, I kept seeing 48. I just kept seeing it over and over again. 48, 48, 48. I'm like, what the, how the fuck I keep seeing this goddamn number? Oh my god! <laughs> it was crazy. But yeah, this double is man, this double is really giving me a powerful energy here. I'm not getting no bad energy with this double. I'm not. I'm more so getting like a let me see. Clarify this double here. Like accepting your ego. You know, not letting your ego control you, but accepting your ego as a part of you. This is like, this is the ego right here. That's the ego. But you know, you can have this side and this side, but some people only choose to be like this all their life. But imagine if you was like this most of your life, and then you finally get into this energy. It's hard to come out this energy and then get in this energy here, you know, because you don't have to do that much work to be in this energy. But it's a lot of work that you have to do to stay in this energy right here. To be positive. Now it's like, I said the roles are switching here. It's like now you're being seen like this while somebody else trying to be seen is like keeping the peace. No, nah, nah, uh -uh, uh -uh. you keep the peace. You keep the peace with God. 
And right now, you are walking on thin ice with God. Clarify this devil. <laughs> this is so funny. We got awareness. Yeah. Like, be aware of your uh, of your um your ego, your shadow side, your impulses. Be aware of it, but you don't always have to act on it. Now, sometimes you're going to have to act on it, you know what I'm saying, you know, because people be trying. They be trying, you know. But it's good when you don't let your ego run you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, clarify this guy warned them about you, didn't listen. And I'm going to close it out after this, y'all. We got the lovers. You see what I'm saying? God is love, baby. God is love. At the end of the day, God is love. What's the lovers here? With the, with the ace of cups at the bottom. Yeah. We got the king of cups here. Oh my God. Is that an ancestor? Or an angel? I don't know who it is. It's like that's an angel or ancestor out here. I feel like this is an ancestor. The Queen of Cups just came out, y'all. Oh, my fucking God. Oh, my God. What does that mean? What is this lover's King of Cups, Queen of Cups, with this guy warned them about you, didn't listen? I seen the death card. We got truth with um transformation. Truth with transformation. What is going on here? Oh, what is King of Cups? The nine of swords. I don't know, man. This would be a lover here. If we got the nine of swords, what's the queen of cups? <clears throat> the seven of wands with the ace of swords. It's like somebody standing their ground here speaking their truth about something. What's this king of cups with the four of wands? I don't know. I'm, I ain't too sure about this. With the hierophant. I don't know, man. I, I don't know. I feel like. I feel like this is a genuine couple. There's something about this king and queen of cups. I don't know what that's about. The way it just came out like that. Something about 2013 can be significant. So what's the king and queen of cups together? The six of wands. We got the four of pentacles. Letting go of something. What's the four of pentacles in reverse? Letting go of how they... The seven of cups. I don't know if somebody... This is somebody that's thinking about you. Like... I'm not too sure what I'm getting from this. What's this king of cups? this king of cups and I thought this is somebody from your past here who this king of cups because I ain't trying to make it seem like this is a lover like somebody you about to find love or something so I'm not too sure if that's what I'm getting here with that this king of cups because it could be an ancestor here or something I was getting the ancestor oh my gosh Ray came back out again Ray came back out again y'all again with God isolated you spirit is contacting you something about it ooh somebody could be getting a trust fund here you can have a trust fund. Someone did a ritual on you. Well, we got shootout. Oh my gosh. Fucking villain error. Villain error came out, y'all. Can't nobody get... This is the perfect message on, on the back of this card. They cannot get in your way because you're in your villain error now. You lower than me, so what's up? You find out that somebody here is lower than you. They try to... Somebody here tried to sell your soul to get rich. And they ain't nowhere near ranked as high as you. There's going to be a shootout here. Because there's something about this Ray in the shoe out. I don't know what that's talking about. 
You probably got somebody trying to invade your dreams here to do some type of ritual on you. Somebody ritual is not working here. Somebody could have stole something from you here, but you about to get ready to get it back. I don't see. That's what I'm saying. I don't know who this King of Cups is. I don't know who the King of Cups is, to be honest. What's the Queen of Cups? We got a villain error out here. Like, stop playing. We got fire. This girl is on fire. We got manipulate court. My ex did it. Missing. And Jesus descendant. Let me go and fold this read now, y'all. Something about a fire can be significant here. But like I said, somebody is in a fucking villain era right now. You know, doing the damn thing. As you should. I don't know why I'm gonna I'm gonna hold up one of the cards as a uh, message. Let me see which one I'm gonna hold up. <laughs> time for the word to change. Should I hold up time for the word to change? I'm going to hold up a couple of them because I don't know which one I want to use as a uh, as a screenshot. I might do Roman's Revenge as a screenshot. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I might do Roman's Revenge. You know. Because we don't have to get revenge. But I bet you our motherfucking ancestors get some goddamn revenge out this hole. What you talking about? Okay. Okay. Okay, my aboriginals. Okay. Tell them stop playing with us. Stop playing. Stop playing with you. Play about this Aboriginal right quick. We got to protect your energy. <laughs> I be so hyped. <laughs> play about Aboriginal man. I don't play about God. Like, period. And God means a plethora of things for me. But at the end of the day, I don't play. I don't play, baby. Mm -mm, not over here. We got recover personal value, addicted to toxicity. Child, let me call the damn reading. And Aquarius can be significant. You could be an Aquarius. <clears throat> All right, let's close this out. I'm going to go ahead and close the reading out. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video, my loves. I say, mwah.